It is 947. If the kiddos are watching right now or if they're in the room, make them watch the TV because, man, they love this one. Carl, what are we doing today? We're talking about air pressure today, and we're talking about peeps. Okay, okay. it wouldn't be Easter without peeps, right? It would it's an not old tradition. Be. It is, and people love these things. And these things are made of millions and millions of tiny little air pockets. Okay, that's why they're so poofy? Exactly. Okay. They're so soft and yeah. chewy and whatnot. So instead of getting right to the peeps, we're first going to look at some, marshmallow, um, some balloons, okay. I should say. I got some balloons inside my vacuum chamber. We're going to remove the air from the vacuum chamber and see what happens to the 10 or 12 or so balloons inside there. Ah. As we remove the air from the outside, okay. the air on the inside of the balloon can begin to expand. Nice. And the balloons will get larger and larger and larger. And if we let it go long enough, some of them might actually even pop. Sure. Oh, yeah. Just Run like that. Run out of space in there. Okay. okay. And were those balloons just filled with... Regular, regular air. Okay. Now, the cool thing is if we let the air back inside and equalize the air pressure, like that. Oh, wow. You can see a few more popped, but they all go back to their original yeah. size. Yeah, yeah. Okay? Cool. So we're going to do that with peeps now. All right. Because peeps have not just a handful of air pockets, but they've got millions of air pockets. Of yeah, get all that okay. junk out of the way. And we're going to put our peeps right in the middle. That's pretty oh, good. Oh, wow. So we're going to put the whole jar inside okay. there and see what happens when we take the air away from millions of air pockets. And how many peeps are we talking? My guess would be maybe like 25? 25, 30, something okay. like that. All yeah. Right. Now, the peeps are a little bit more interesting because they've got that marshmallowy, gooiness structure right. to them. Mm -hmm. You can actually see some of them start to crack. Yeah, because they have the sugar. You know, when you start to peel one away, that's what you see. That sugary okay. coating. Wow. But the other really interesting thing is at some point, these are going to get really, really big, which they have, and now they're oh. starting to shrink down a little bit. Because just like those balloons before that popped, uh -huh. we're actually ripping apart the structure of the peep. So they have nowhere else to expand? They have no more air inside to expand. Uh -huh. Exactly. Okay. So they're going to get, they're going to relax a little bit. But if we really want them to relax, uh -huh. I'll let you pull that little, Kay. pull that little thing away. Wow. And they get really, really small. Okay, now are they hard is the question. Well, go ahead. Oh, and... kind, well, kind of. Because well, you know how the... some people leave them out? Yeah, well, then they kind of dry out. But with this, we've actually removed the air from the inside. Oh, so wow. now they're really kind of really deflated. Yeah, very they're, flat. They're not quite as fluffy. Mm. Now, even better than that would be something that does not have that structure to it, like Ready Whip. Oh, okay. Just whipped cream with some air inside. Okay. So if we put a nice little container here. We're going to put this jar back on top and do the same sort of experiment. Okay. Remove the air from the outside of the Ready Whip. All right. And see what happens as it begins to expand. Oh, boy. So we'll connect up our vacuum pump. Turn it on. Same sort of thing, right? Sure. It's like see, a growing ice cream cone. You might be a little disappointed there, but because it looks like it's doing the same thing. Uh -huh. But here, what we don't have is the gooiness of the peep. Ah. When we let the air back inside, you tell me, how long do we have to let this grow here? I, I think we're almost reaching maximum capacity here. All right, here we go. We let the air back inside. Oh. Yeah, not as nice. <laughs> and so, because the Ready Whip is made up of just cream with a little bit of air inside. Yeah, and so, so there's no air for there's, there's nothing left over. It's gotcha. all just liquid. Man, well, the science but. of peeps and air pressure <laughs> Exactly. Today. It's kind of cool. fun. Very cool. That's this week's Imagine It. Carl, thanks so much. And if you want to go down to the Imagination Station, you guys are open today, correct? We're open today, and we're doing the Egg Drop Challenge, Very where you can cool. build a structure to support an egg as you throw it over the edge of our atrium. Sweet. Sounds That's good. That's at the Imagination Station. You can go visit them. They are closed for Easter Sunday and then open on Monday because it is spring break. You can also check out Dinosaurs on Earth. It's your final chance to do so. Carl, thanks so much. Happy Easter sure. to you thanks. from there. Let's go check in with the guys of sports.